Hey everyone, quick update. I'm on holiday, so while I'm away, our intros will be a bit different. But don't worry, I'm still here, reading your comments and staying connected. Hit like if you enjoyed today's episode. Drop a comment for me to check out. And don't forget to subscribe for more. Fancy extra content? Check out my Patreon. Enjoy the episode, and I'll see you in the comments. Okay, <clears throat> story order, here we go. Um... Hey, it's me again, Johnny. Today I have this um, sports sacon for you. Rust isn't sparing this model, especially when it's not kept in the garage. It's stood between cactuses, so it looks as if drowned. Even though the body works up for complete renovation, the mechanics don't look bad. The owner was a fireball who drove it like there was no tomorrow and probably heated up the engine. Of course, he didn't have the time nor the ambition to take care of it, and he abandoned it. Please tidy it up. I think that we'll manage to sell it as the perfect example. The mileage will not arouse suspicions. I'm waiting for your call. See you. Okay, let's take this order. Okay, here we go. Now, uh, if we look at the car, we've got a lot of body parts to figure out. I know already what these body parts are because I've got the cheat sheet in front of me. Then we need to replace or repair these body parts. I'm not going to repair them. I'm just going to replace them. Then drain the oil, spray it the factory color, and then, yeah, change all the liquids and headline, uh, headlight alignment and wheels alignment. Let's do it. Let's go wash the car first. See what we're working with here. There's no light. Okay. Okay, cool. Let's move this baby back into the garage. Now, even though I have the cheat sheet, it is good to actually do all of your scans so that you can uh, get your XP. We want to be upgrading so that we can get points to get better. Then we do this fuel pressure test. Hey, perfect. And uh, if you guys remember, in the last episode, we actually upgraded so uh, or leveled up. So let's quickly uh, buy our upgrades. I want to have, uh, we've got eight points. Hmm. Hmm. So I'm thinking, cut examination time. Yeah, that doesn't bother us. Increase mounting, screen speed. Let's do this. Let's do uh, that one. And then also let's do, this is going to cost four. Let's do the running faster. Yeah, okay, and we already upgraded everything here, and we also have a case. Let's open that and see what we've got Let's see another case. I'll take that some credits don't need that, but it's good So the case was there. Let's do here. Oh And this one, okay got some bonus XP. I like that nice. Okay. Let us do our examination Okay, perfect so we still have some parts undiscovered, but that is not a big problem. <coughs> Repair or replace the body parts and then, okay, let's uh, drain. Let's drain all the things that we need to drain so that we don't forget later on. And then we can buy all the body parts according to the cheat sheet. And remember, I will, I will put the link to the cheat sheet in the description. Oh, that's, ooh, that's, that is used oil. I will pull, I will put the link for the cheat sheet in the description down below so you can follow along if you're really struggling on a build and you don't understand why you can use the cheat sheet to help you. Okay, cool. So let's quickly go buy all the things we need. We're going to head down to the electronic shop because we need the ABS pump. We need the pump and we need the battery battery. Okay, then I'm just I'm just checking. Do we need anything more from the the, uh, the Electronics uh, shop. No, we don't. Okay, let's do this. So crankshaft crankshaft 14b 14b. Yep uh, Crankshaft bearing cap. I'm gonna need two of them. Okay engine head 14b this one Front shock absorber cap. Two fuel injectors. Fuel injector. 14B. Right. I need. I need four fuel pump. 
fuel pump, normal one. Yeah, and a fuel tank. A fuel tank. Fuel tank, normal one. Intake manifold, 14B. Intake manifold, 14B. This one. Then we need the oil filter. Oil filter, 14. Piston rings. Piston rings, normal ones, right? Uh, yeah, four piston rings and four piston with con rods. Okay, a radiator, radiator fan housing fan. Okay, it doesn't say number, so we'll just do that one. And then lastly, we're gonna need rod caps. Oh, nope, rod cap. And we need three of them. Perfect, perfect, okay. Okay, and then the actual body parts that we need to replace. It's gonna be uh, the left and right uh, headlight and taillight, the rear window and the left side mirror. Okay, so the left and right, left taillight and headlight, right taillight, uh, seems like I'm missing something. Left headlight, um, rear window, so we've got Left side mirror, left side mirror. Okay, we've got both taillights, we've got both headlights, got the mirror, and we've got the uh, the rear window. Just see, yep, 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 yes, I think we've got all of it. And then spray it the factory paint. So let's go spray paint first. Factory color, this is not something that we would do in real life. You would uh, fix on the entire, you would fix the body first, right? No, no, we don't want to move the car. We want to add stuff. Okay, we want to take this rear window out. Oh, it doesn't have one. Oh, my bad. And I believe that is all the, yeah, that is all of that. Okay, cool. Let's, uh, normal mode. Um, do we need, what do we need to work on the underside of the car? Yeah, we're gonna have to get into that, uh, oil pan, right? Because we need to get rid of the pistons so and we need to get the fuel pump let's do the fuel pump uh, we've got all of these parts let's just highlight them make our job easier okay so I know for a fact I need to replace this and I need to replace this see here fuel tank we've got that okay so I've received a comment on one of my videos saying that I should explain what the parts do um, that I add into the the uh, builds. Now, I have to apologize. I do not know a lot about cars. Not enough to give you um, good advice or, or tell you in great detail what these uh, these parts do. But I can try, you know, I can try to talk about the parts or what I assume they do. So I'm going to do that now. The fuel tank, obviously, it holds the fuel, right? The fuel pump, that pumps the fuel from the tank to the engine. That is my assumption. That is honestly my assumption. So yeah, if there are some uh, mechanics watching this, please leave in the comment section below what these parts actually do. It will help out the people watching that want to know. Like, I really want to give you the details. So the oil filter, it filters out the oil. It's in the name, right? Um, yeah, so maybe there's some debris that gets mixed into the oil and the oil filter filters that out. Um, I would really like to give people more details as to what each part does, but I honestly, I don't know enough about cars to be able to do that. When I started, when I started playing, it was just for fun, you know? I, I never intended these videos to be informative. I didn't know that people would would uh, want to watch for the, the fact that these parts do these things and um, what it's used for. I did not expect that. So I do apologize if I, if I was supposed to do that, but this was me basically just wanting to play a game, right? So I will, I will try, I will try to give details on what parts do. It's just, I do not know a lot about it. So why am I taking the wheels off? Because I am going to have to get that gearbox off so that I can get to the crankshaft. Okay, and then, uh, 
let's see here i can take out the uh front drive shaft and then i cannot take the gearbox off because we have the starter that's still on the car let's get to that starter quickly okay and uh yeah so I'll, i will try i will I, I will honestly try to give as much detail as i can when i add parts not when i take them off um Otherwise, we're going to sit here, not get through the, uh, the things that we need to do, because I'll be spending time talking about each part. Okay, okay, so we cannot take out the crankshaft yet, because we still have some parts holding it down. But, I believe, because we have everything, we didn't waste any time, we can actually, maybe, hopefully finish this story order in this episode. That would be great, you know? But yeah. Uh, please remember to, uh, if you like my content, please remember to like this video, subscribe to the channel, hit that notification bell, and leave a comment down below on any tips, tricks, questions, or concerns that you might have. I always try to, I always try to reply to each comment, even though if it's a bad comment or not, I always try to reply, and I think I've done so thus far. Also, please go check out our Patreon page, the link is in the description. You can get some exclusive perks uh, for a very small uh, monthly uh, contribution. It helps the channel out. It helps me out. And I do appreciate it very much. Why? Why? I also need to take this part. No, 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 no. Where are you going? Come here. Okay. Ooh, we've got a lot of stuff here. So yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna try and push to get this car done as soon as humanly possible. Okay. Okay, get that crankshaft out of there. Okay, now uh, putting back everything that we bought already. So the crankshaft. Oh, uh, hmm. So the the crankshaft makes the pistons go up and down or no that doesn't that's not true. Um there's there's some combustion happening in the engine, right? Uh that small explosion in the chamber, the piston chamber pushes down the piston, okay? And in turn this pressing down force turns that crankshaft and that crankshaft then goes on to give power or some movement to the flywheel and then the clutch and then that gives power to your wheels and that makes you move forward and that's my understanding so again please if i'm wrong please tell me in the comments down below try to be nice though um <laughs> i uh i understand that maybe you find <laughs> it annoying that uh, I'm explaining something in the wrong way. I am I'm ignorant when it comes to stuff like this. So educate us if I made a mistake, but do it in a nice way. Come on, we're decent human beings, right? Okay, so the rod caps, well, it holds the piston to the crankshaft and then the crankshaft bearing cap also keeps it in place. The oil pan, so this is for the oil to sit in your engine needs lubrication, right? So that's where that happens. The flywheel, this takes power from your crankshaft and distributes it into uh, your gear system, your yeah, uh, clutch plate. This disengages this entire system for when you change gears, right? The clutch pressure plate. Um, yeah, I have no idea what a clutch pressure plate does. Um, <laughs> So I'm sorry. The gearbox, that's where all your gears are. So if you wanna if you wanna move to a higher gear, this that's your gears are chosen here. So it, when you press when you uh uh press down on your clutch pedal, if you do not have automatic, if you have a manual or a stick drive car, when you press down on your clutch pedal, that engages the clutch uh pressure plate or clutch release bearing, and then that allows you to choose a, a different gear the front drive shaft i assume i assume the power coming from the gears is what gives power to the uh, drive shaft and then from the drive shaft to the drive axles and that in turn turns your wheels so this car is a front wheel drive 
we can see that because there's no drivetrain that goes to the back um it goes directly into the the wheels the front wheels I believe that is everything under the car that needs to be done. Okay, let's see. We've got the crankshaft done. Engine head is not completely done yet. Uh, yeah, all of this is done. Okay, those three parts there, is, uh, they're not discovered yet. Uh, that's because it's this. So we shouldn't be... <laughs> We shouldn't have lowered the car yet because we're not done. Um, we don't need to pick it up. We can just... Oh, sorry, guys. Mm, yeah, I need this one. Because I need this shock. Uh, on the other side. Okay. Cool, 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 cool. Let's uh, separate these parts. This video might be a little longer than normal because I do believe we can actually finish this entire car in this uh, video. I think so. I'm not sure. I do not plan out my videos ahead. I just literally I start the game and I play like <laughs> so I don't script. I script the intro part, right? I don't script the actual gameplay. Okay, let's just let's just save. Got yeah, part not discovered. Intake manifold, part not discovered. That's because it's the uh, it's the pump. Okay, basically putting everything back together. Now the question remains: Can I finish this car fast enough? Let's hope that I can. No, I didn't buy, didn't buy, oh crap, I didn't buy a fuel filter. Sorry, sorry, my bad. No, fuel filter, that's my bad, sorry. Oh, yeah, so I said I'll, I'll talk about the parts as I'm installing them. This is gonna be, this is gonna be something that I'm gonna have to get used to. Because I haven't done that in before so i do apologize just bear with me it's going to take me time to get into the habit of talking about what each part does and um i'm trying to press and finish this uh this story order as soon as i possibly can uh but i do promise i will start doing it more often okay let me see how much we're gonna make a quite a good profit on this And I believe that is it. Now we just need to refill the fluids, do the uh, wheel alignment and headlight alignment, and then we're done. I think uh, that is pretty cool. We've managed to start a story order and finish it in the same video. Okay, moving the car to the test path. Perfect. And then the headlight alignment. Okay, this car is done. Spray it the factory spray car with factory paint. That's what I did. That's what I did. Factory color. Yeah. Oh, uh, hmm. Factory color. That's what I did. So why does it say? Hmm. I think maybe I have to uh, use the welder. Let's see. Is that what I needed to do? No. Spray it with factory color. I don't understand what's going on. I did. Repair or replace. Spray it the factory color. What was the factory color? Yeah, that's white. Hmm. Hmm. Paint shop. Paint shop. Yeah. So it's, nope, that's nothing. Factory color. Yeah, so the factory. Yeah, that's the factory color. Um. Oh, okay. Factory colors. Paint type. Gloss. Metallic. Let's make it black. See if that works. Gloss. Gloss. Spray it the factory color. I don't understand why it's not. Hmm. Done everything here. Done everything here. Spray it the factory color. Uh, it is the factory color. It's like, I don't understand. Does it want me to. 
Replace these body parts? We've already repaired. Spray the factory color. What? What the hell is going on? I don't understand why. What's the cheat sheet saying? Uh, okay. Cheat sheet doesn't say anything. Uh, spray car with factory paint. That's, I did that. Okay. Yeah, that's, so it should, it should, that according to the sh cheat sheet, it should be okay. And I don't understand why it's not allowing me to, the factory color. Factory color, gloss, gloss. Let's do that, paint type. And then we try to do the body parts because I really honestly cannot tell why this is this is happening. Like this doesn't make any sense to me and I, I have to, hmm, spray the factory color. This makes no sense at all. What if I do this? Body parts, this is the only thing that I can think of. This shouldn't be the problem, but let's just, let's just do it anyway. This makes no sense at all. I'm gonna lose my crap if I, if this was the problem. And I'm gonna lose it even more if it's not. No, it's not. What the hell is going on? Spray it the factory color. I did that. I did spray it the factory color. So this doesn't make any sense to me. That's the only thing that's factory paint. Factory color, gloss. Yes, I'm spending so much money. Luckily I have money to spend or to waste. Okay, finally. Oh my goodness. Oh, <laughs> that was so that was something. Okay. Anyway. Yeah. Uh, I think I'm going to end the video there. Uh, let me just save. <laughs> this game crashes. Okay. So uh, if you like that video. Uh, if you maybe sc screamed at your screen. Your screen the old, entire time. Hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel. And th hit the notification bell. So that you don't miss any of my future uploads. Please leave a comment down below. On any tips, tricks, questions or concerns that you might have. Also go check out our Patreon page. The link is in the description. You get some some cool perks. It also helps me out and the channel. That's going to be all for this video. I hope you have a great day and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.